Fans gathered tonight for a vigil outside of the University of Cincinnati Medical Center where NFL player DeMar Hamlin is in critical condition. The Bills player collapsed last night during the game against the Bengals after a tackle. Medics performed CPR for more than nine minutes on the field before an ambulance rushed him to the hospital. The 24-year-old went into cardiac arrest and he is still in critical condition tonight. In a statement, the Hamlin family is asking for everyone to come together to pray for their family, which is exactly what you see here tonight tonight. The vigil started at 855, the exact same time Hamlin went down during last night's game. And this story, as you might imagine, is causing ripple effects all across the country. As Hallie Turner reports, a college athlete's mom says every time she sees her son in uniform, the thought goes through her mind, what if? Whether you are watching the game or not, you've probably seen photos of it. Players crying, an ambulance brought onto the field, a crowd in disbelief, and it's a scene any parent of a football player dreads. And last night, it hit close to home for a local mom. I had dozed off, and when I woke up and I was like, what is going on? And when I saw what had happened, I mean, honestly, I cried. I mean, because that could have been my baby. The moment brought Bridget Canteen back to the very second her son Derek tore his pectoral muscle playing football for Georgia Southern last year. 2021 is when he had his first serious injury that made me lose my breath. I mean, just seeing him out there on that football field and seeing my baby injured with a um, torn pectoral muscle just really sent me to another world. Even though Derek's football career has been successful, Bridget wasn't always a fan. When Derek was at the age of five years old, my husband, he was getting ready to get deployed and wanted him to play football, and I was totally against it. She says the fear of something like this is what held her back. In your mind, you know, you still have that fear of woulda, coulda, shoulda. Don't want anything to happen, not only to your son, but anybody else's son. Accidents like DeMar Hamlin's are rare, but being ready for them can be the difference in life and death. It's very rare, and I think this entire case highlights uh, the critical need for recognizing cardiac arrest very quickly and responding quickly with excellent bystander CPR. She says football is a sacrifice, but it's the love of the game that outweighs the risk. A lot of sacrificing not only on the family, but also on that individually. If you're not willing to stand behind them and support them as far as the sacrifices that they have to make, I say don't do it. As of right now, doctors are saying Komodo cordis likely causes this cardiac arrest, something that is most commonly seen in teen young males involving ball sports. We'll update you as we learn more about Hamlin's recovery status.